Here comes the model. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Cocoa Beach, Florida, weighing in at 234 pounds, Rick the Model Martel. Can I just say how honorable it is of Rick Martell to have his driver make the trip the whole way across oh, the state? I can't stand the smell of that nasty cologne. It's your designer imposter garbage. The fact that Martell was willing to join us should be applauded. I don't think I've ever seen someone who admires himself as much as the model Rick Martell does. Look at the jawline, Byron Saxton. You would admire yourself if you looked anywhere near as good as Rick Martell. And his opponent this place just got cool. From Miami, Florida, weighing in at 287 pounds. The bad guy, Razor Ramon! Without question, one of the toughest, and some would say cockiest individuals to ever compete here in WWE. I think he just tossed that toothpick at you. No, he missed. Remember his incredible ladder match at WrestleMania 10 against Shawn Michaels? How, who, can, who can forget that? It was a defining moment in WWE history, and it paved the way for some of the greatest superstars of this year. Hey, you know, Razor and I have something in common. We both ooze machismo. Okay, maybe just Razor. Byron, you could somehow make the sun less cool. And there's the bell. And here we go. This is the type of battle that you can show someone who's new to our brand of entertainment and say, this is what WWE's all about. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. That's how you wear down your opponent. Oh, continuing to punish them. Oh my goodness, crushing it. Razor Ramon starting to falter now. With these two guys, we all knew this was going to be an all-out oh, battle. Man. Oh, that might have just broken something. Uh -oh. Not the oh, oh my goodness, crushing it. Beautiful technique. Oh, look at the elbow after. Dodges that one. Oh, high impact. His shoulders are down. And an easy kick out from Razor Ramon. It's way too early. Not looking like himself here, but he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound. I know it's somewhat early still, but this could be a pivotal point in this match, guys. Let's see how he reacts here. Oh, nasty impact. Just carrying the opposition here. But you can't carry your opponent all day. You gotta make a move eventually.
Oh, he's able to reverse it. He's expending a lot of energy, so he's got to keep that in mind. Look at Razor Ramon. It's coming. Cow! What a choke slam. This might be the opportunity he needed. He's got to do more damage before he can get a three count. It'll take a lot more than that to keep him down. Here we go. Razor Ramon is setting it up. We're going to see it. Way up there. Takes him down in a major way, too. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. What a strike. Two. Rick Martel, too quick. A quick reversal by Razor Ramon. Three. Razor Ramon is in a tough spot right now. I'd say he's starting to feel the pressure a bit. This is one of the more evenly matched contests we've seen in quite some time. From the looks of things, it could really go either way. He's going for the pin. Referee barely had time to begin a count there. Nice kick out. Oh boy, he is rolling. Ah! Uh, just breaking down the opponent. Let's talk some history that involved the bad. Rick Martin cross body by the model. Can he end it here? You gotta believe this one's over. What a clothesline! Ouch! He goes for the cover. Taking on any more damage here could very well mean the beginning of the end. Oh my goodness, this hurts! Oh! Vicious strike. Oh no! Someone called the orthodontist. Oh boy, he is rolling. Here we go a second time. Down. What a choke slam. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Can he score the pin? Too close for cover. Yeah, but he's hurt, guys. Looking for the finish. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. This might be it. Oh, my. What a stomp. Good grief. Nailed it. Rick Martell is getting ready. Beautiful gut-wrench suplex by the model. That has got to be it. He's got him down. This is it. Two. Gets the shoulder up. Wow. What's it going to take? The bad guy kicks out. There was a razor-thin margin of error there. Enough with the puns. I can't help it. What a slam. Impactful. It will jar your spine. I think we're about to see a high-risk move from the top rope. Oh, no. We know Ooh, with precision. It is going to take a minor miracle. Shoulders down. Two. I wouldn't have been surprised if that was it. Wow. We're going to take more than that. A leverage pin here. Hey, it's only cheating if you get caught. Oh, my. How in the world did he kick out of that? Not yet. Suplex! He's expending a lot of energy, so he's got to keep that in mind. Here he goes. Down! What a choke slam! 
but he's running on fumes here. Does he have it? He may get the three count right here. This is it. A kick out, and he almost had him. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Uh-oh. The bad guy setting up from way up high. Here we go. Ooh. Razor's edge. Here's Razor Ramon's chance to take home the win. He's got the shoulders down. One, two, three. What a win for Razor Ramon. That match is worth another look. Here we go. Check him out here. I remember this part very well. Remember this? And this is how he ended it. Here is your winner, the bad guy, Razor Ramon. Talk about having to dig down deep to pick up the win. Hey, they both gave it their all, but in the end, we were left with the best man standing. Guys, somehow the Elimination Chamber manages to get even more exciting with each passing year.